Let's hear from Nets head coach Steve Nash, who just sat down with the media. Hey, Steve, just uh, looking at that stretch in the fourth quarter, their 18-1 run, what did you think kind of turned the game and, and uh, where did you guys struggle in that stretch? Yeah, we had a poor stretch. You know, I, I, I think it was a it was a little bit of a, a photo of the night in general is that they were just overall more physical than us at both ends of the floor. Um, you know, our team, our gap for our team is that we don't have a common history. You know, we, we're brand new. Everything's new. We've changed teams more or less a number of times. So, um, we got a gap to make up as far as our, uh, you know, our understanding of one another. And while we make up that gap, we got to be more physical. We got to win 50, 50 balls and we have to do the dirty work, you know, because we have to give ourselves some sort of buffer while we figure each other out, while we get more familiar with our schemes and our sets and, um, you know, give us, give us, uh, you know, like I said, that little cushion where maybe it's not as smooth. It's not as, um, seamless at all times, but we're still able to scrap and claw and stay in the games. Bruce Beck, NBC New York. Steve, the 15 offensive rebounds by by the Bucks is that kind of what you're talking about in terms of hustle, in terms of you know uh, tenacity tonight? That that was definitely in their favor. It is a great indicator. You know, I think it, it tells a story um, of, a, of a slightly bigger picture than just the rebounds. But, the, you know, they did a great job being physical at both ends. Uh, they got a lot of offensive rebounds. They got into us defensively. You know, we had our chance. You know, I think it was early in the fourth. We went up f five points uh, and then had a really sloppy stretch. I think you said an 18-1 run. So, you know, we had our chances. Um, we, we didn't execute when it really mattered, but a great opportunity for us to take something from this series, from this game, and, and grow from it. Alex Schiffer, The Athletic. Hey, Steve. It seemed like you kind of kept the same tactic for, for guarding Giannis tonight. Now, obviously, he, he didn't drop 50 like he did last time. Just what would you make of the, the effort there and the job you guys did on him this time around? Yeah, you know, very similar. Um, we made a few mistakes, but overall, you're going to live with a lot of the shots he took. Uh, he didn't shoot it as well tonight, and... You know, again, it was, uh, you know, that's not the reason we lost. You know, I think uh, you talk about all the offensive rebounds, you talk about the 50-50 balls, you talk about missing 10 free throws. You know, there's a lot of areas that we could clean up. Brian Lewis, New York Post. Steve, in terms of the uh, physicality, is it fair to say that that's not really a, a personnel issue or a roster issue? That's more of a, a grit issue? I mean, there was a couple plays down the stretch where Middleton came through the lane and there really was not a lot of physical resistance. Yeah, I mean, I, I think it's not necessarily the forte of our roster, um, but there's no excuse for for not trying to match or, you know, be more physical than the other team. And so that's something that we got to work out. We got to be diligent about. We got to make it a, you know, a tangible goal for ourselves and, uh, you know, and collectively do it and do it for one another to go the extra mile for your teammates. So that, that's something that we got to emphasize and continue to grow into. Christian Winfield, New York Daily News. Hey, Coach, I, I think it was a 16-1 to 1 run that they went on in the fourth quarter, and I, I think a few of us were a little surprised that there wasn't a timeout call. Was that a tactical play there by you, or, or did time just go by pretty quickly? Uh, you know, we could have called timeout here and there for sure, but... <laughs> You know, I think there's a, there's also a part of our team that you want to learn to problem solve. And we're getting good looks at the basket for, at stretches. And so you want to keep having them problem solve. You want to keep them attacking. And, you know, tonight maybe I could have called another timeout. Um, but you also want to make sure you save a few for the end of the game. And um, so you're always caught in that little dilemma. But, you know, maybe, uh, maybe, there, maybe I should have. But at the same time, I, I don't think that was, like, going to make a big difference at that point.